players who are watching these girls in training. And they're certainly holding the kind of form that they were showing in practice. There's Nick McCrory cheering them on from the sidelines. Great support for these divers here today. All about holding your nerve. This is a precision sport. It's all about consistency. And the Americans certainly coming out with a bit of consistency. Some funny arm movements there, but there we go. Up over the top. Beautiful overhead shot there. I think they're going to get some nines for that one. <laughs> they match the British score. Nines in Simpro and 8.5 and execution. Americans go into second place. Well, on to the Canadians. Following the Americans with a forward dive. Second after round one. Is Emily Haywards and Jennifer Abel. How they were approaching the end of the diving board there. And from here it's okay. We can see on the replay, arms up into the pike shape, oh, marginally out of time, in and out of the pike shape. Entry into the water is actually good alignment, just as it's on the diving board, still hitting yeah. the water. Jennifer there, moving very close towards Emily, trying to hold hands on the way down. Oh my goodness, look, she was right in the corner. Well done, Jennifer, you did well there to hold that. My goodness, that could have been much worse than it was. The Canadian's still in it, I think. Could I call it a scruffy dive? <laughs> Nothing nice or edifying about that dive from the start to the end, was there? It just didn't look great at any stage. Um. And uh, they were punished for that. 57.40, the marks are down. That's Pam and Chiong from Malaysia. Well, the, sh the shabby in the water there, that certainly tried to my attention. Obviously been thrown in by one of the divers. That's why the divers use to dry themselves off in between rounds to make sure they don't slip when they're in the shape. So here we are. This is the back one and a half somersaults with the half a twist. There's the half a twist into the fly position or the free position. The Malaysians are probably a little bit off the pace now. Wouldn't be surprised if, uh, if they're towards the bottom of the field at the end of this contest, but still a long way to go. Uh, look back at the scoreboard. They'll see what you're seeing on your screen. Eight on the left. Eight point zeros and seven point fives will count on the right. Yeah, a bit of a shake of the head, going not quite how we'd uh, plan that to go, and not how it went in training. Now these girls need a bit of a pick up as well. Smenska and Fedorova of Ukraine. Well, it's reasonably okay. I mean, again, the approach on the hurdle step, that's what we call the hurdle step, coming to the end of the diving board. Seems to be a little bit out of time, but I managed to get it together in the end. The judges are inputting the scores as we speak, and let's look at the replay. Yeah, a little bit of overbalancing coming into their diver closest to us. You can see both divers, it needs to be a mirror image, so the, I think only eights for synchro. Uh, maybe even a seven and a half, I'm not sure. Let's wait and see what the judges think. But they'll be towards the bottom of the field, I think, after the first two rounds. Not happy faces there, Mr. Tanska and Federova. Eights will not cut it today. They need to be far higher up the food chain than that. China, USA, Italy after round two. Great Britain in fourth place. Just ahead of... Uh,